Um, hello. So when we um, came to this hackathon, we decided to explore the kitchen consumption space to see where we could make adjustments for a more sustainable future. And so, hi, we are PMS, and this is what we came up with. <laughs> So um, we decided to tackle water. We had a list of resources we wanted to tackle in, in order to get a more sustainable future. And water was our top priority. You'll see why. Because um, when you think of water, you think of this very limited resource that even though it's renewable, we really renew it at a really slow rate. And that's why we really wanted to conserve that first. So annually, there are 900 billion gallons of water used in American households. And this is a breakout of the usage uh, in household water in the household water consumption. And uh, even though bath bathroom is uh, obviously the uh, common uh, place where we use water, 36% of the uh, annual water usage is wasted in the kitchen. So the solution we came out with, we made a product called Tap Out. Um, so basically, what we're doing is this process right here. So the process is. We first check if the tap is on, and we check if the user is in front of the tap. And if, if both of them are uh, satisfied, we alert the user by a buzzer and also a text message. So the hardware we use for this is a PIR motion sensor to check if the user is in front of the tap, we, uh, a magnetic contact to see if the tap is on or off, and a buzzer as a sound. Uh, so we use the motions. Uh, we actually wanted the flow sensor, but since we didn't have it, we uh, make shifted <laughs> with the uh, motion sensor. So uh, as when the user is in front of the motion sensor, uh, the IR is blocked, and that's how it knows that the user is present or not. And the mo uh, magnetic contact is actually placed between the tap. So if, if when you switch on the tap, the ta uh, magnetic contact is broken. And when you close it, it's, uh, it's closed. Oh, and um, the software additions we added to this was IFTTT, which stands for if this, then that. It's basically a, a cause and effect program, which we use. So whenever we find that there is no person in front of the tap and it is still running, we send a text message to the phone. Uh, and for future enhancements, we thought we could apply the same concept to the lighting, the exhaust, and the stove. And to show you a demo of what we made, um, so right now we have a live feed of what's the status of the situation in the sink. Since the IR is so sensitive, we actually kept it in the dark to d represent that there's no person or no motion. And showing that, that there is a per no person and the tap is open, we get a. We, the uh, buzzer uh, is. We, the buzzer buzzes, the light turns on, and a message is sent to the phone. Um, we use Telegram for this, and that is our project. Yeah,